Hello, and welcome to Common Core for Kids Nightly News. Tonight, we have a very special report on someone amazing. That would be me, of course, the number one. Let's take a look at the news story that happened to me today. Hey kids, I have this problem here. I have this straw, and it measured 40 centimeters long, but then I was told to cut it with a pair of scissors. So after it got cut, it now only measures 26 centimeters long. I need to know how much I cut off the straw. I am stuck since I am not sure how to figure it out. I do have this number line that I can use to help me get the answer. Do you guys think I can use the number line to help me find the answer? Great! Then let's figure it out together. Okay, here we have 40, and this is how long the straw measured before it was cut. Here we see 26, which is how long the straw is after it was cut. We need to find the length of the piece that was cut off. So if we counted down the number line from 40 to 26, we should be able to find the length of the piece that was cut. We need to count down all these numbers, but that might take a long time. Let me think of a way to make it go faster. I know. Let's count backwards by 10 so it can go faster. Let's start at 40 and count back 10. When we count back 10, we get to 30. Let's count back 10 again. Oops, we hit 20. That's too far back. So let's go back to 30 and start counting back by 1s. We start at 30 and start counting back. 29, 28, 27, 26. Great job! We got to 26. Now we need to count the jumps that we made. There's 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So the answer is 14 centimeters. The piece of straw that was cut is 14 centimeters long. Great job, guys! Now if we were to look at this problem and write an equation from this, we could solve it without a number line. Let's take a look at how to do this. So we started with the straw that was 40 centimeters long, and we cut off a piece, but we do not know how much we cut off. We do know that we were left with the straw that measured 26 centimeters. You can see here that we have formed an equation by reviewing this problem. We started with 40, as you see here, and we cut off or subtracted an amount, and we are left with 26 centimeters. So we have 40 subtract the unknown number, which equals 26. Great job so far, but we are not done yet. One cool thing I have learned is that I can rewrite this to say 40 subtract 26 equals the unknown number. If we started with 40 centimeters and took away 26 centimeters, we would get the unknown number. So now the problem is easier to see. Let's work the math. 40 subtract 26. Well, 0 subtract 6 does not work. So we regroup by taking a 10 from the 4. Now we have 10 minus 6, and that equals 4. Let's move on to the 10's place. We have 3 minus 2, which gives us 1. We can now see the answer is 14, just like we figured out with the number line. Now this seemed a little harder, but with practice, I know we will get it. Thanks for learning with me, guys. We will talk to you later. Goodbye. Thank you for watching. Please share the video and subscribe.